Okay. I am live. What's up, folks? Gonna be joined up by a T Dog Turin. Haggard. Let me, uh. Go ahead and click get ready. Alright, dude. How's okay. the game going? You got uh, gear match yet? Not, not yet. I clicked the search for him. Sounds good. There it goes. Welcome your screen. back, Spot. Oh, I'm capturing the wrong screen. Oh, no, it's all good, man. Let's go to OBS here. Oh, uh, for, um, are you talking about to share with me or to share with your OBS? To share with OBS. Um, game capture. You do game capture, then you do specific window, and then you click on, uh, Blood Wolf. Should work. Uh, come here. It's under settings, right? Let me see here. Video. Maybe not video. If you were sharing your screen, I could see. Uh, I thought it was. Whoops. Oh, uh, not in Discord. No. Gotta hide all that dirty stuff on your desktop. Yes. Okay. So hit cancel. Uh, get out of this window, and then, um, did you add a new source? There you go. Here, I'll just, uh, start yeah. from scratch. Yeah, start from scratch. We'll get it set up, brother. Oh, it just appeared. Uh, oh. Uh, I guess it's saved on under this one. Yeah, it's safe. It's safe before good, it was good just enough. Yeah, good enough. Okay. Uh, yeah, no. <laughs> Surprisingly, no inducements for the first game. Yeah, not yet. Not yet. Uh, we will take the ball. <laughs> you think it's better to take the ball in the first half, or to just like what? I, I what? do. Yeah, you do. I think it's yeah. always better because. Having the opportunity to remove somebody from the game first is infinitely better in my mind. Even against the Dread Dowie, though? Yes. Yeah, okay, very cool. Yeah, I, I mean, otherwise the Dowie are just going to bash me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, Jonathan chat said, let the boy bash. Yeah, th you know, you actually, you have Mighty Blow, right? So what does Mighty Blow do in Blood Bowl 3? Uh, when an opponent is knocked down, following a block by this player, you can change the armor value or injury test by the amount between brackets. What does that even mean, dude? I'm too I much of know. a potato done. That's, <laughs> <laughs> that's not plus one to injury roll, which is what I know. Yeah, yeah. The, the value... The, dread, the dreaded Minotaur up here. Plus one to the armor check, is what he's saying? Okay. Wait, you have orcs on your team? I have a orc. Is he, is he strength four? No, strength three. Just a standard okay. orc line. Got it. With animosity. Dude, this and team is so everybody haggard. Everybody on my team has animosity. <laughs> <laughs> this team is so janky, dude. It's just a you bunch of like... You gotta tell me. Oh my god. Does your bull have frenzy? Yes. So does okay, my so ravager. You... Oh, okay, so you have a lot of surfing potential on this team. Yes. Dude, I can see you lining up for the surf right now. What do you mean? Oh, wait. What is that rat that you have? You have a rat it's on your team also? Yeah, they're all like linemen. Oh. So all I get is other other linemen and then the goblin. But I, I didn't pick a goblin because goblins are terrible. Yeah. So this is like the equivalent of the Old World Alliance, but for Chaos. You get like a bunch of like haggard mixing of like the, the bad guy factions. And they all have animosity. <laughs> Welcome, okay. Valnir. You're in the right place. Mm. Okay. 
A little bit of bashing. The big one managed to lay out an opponent it's always of disappointing, right? Thing? The first dice is not going down. Of course. Dude, you can literally just surf this guy into the Shadow Realm, Push though. Back. Like, over a couple turns, like, since dwarves can't really dodge, you can just, like... <laughs> you can straight up just work him out of bounds. It's actually kind of cool. Fight can be so okay, this is going There's exactly how I expected it. Scrap. It's a great, great start. You have all those, like, haggard humans. Oh, your humans are, are uh, armor value 9, though? Uh, sure. That's not bad. Are normal humans just 8? Mm-hmm. Yeah, the, on the Imperial Nobility, they're all 8. I think your Chaos ones are a little bit tankier, I'm not sure. Tanking big guy hits first, like, uh, Goji talking... You see Goji talking smack and chat about you, dude? Uh, well deserved. <laughs> Goji thinks he owns the place, dude. Yeah. You don't know nothing. The only thing... Out-of-bounds injuries don't seem to give SVP. Hmm, interesting. I didn't know that. They... Yeah, they... I don't think they... They never did, because the crowd does the injury. Yeah, yeah. It's so worth it, you know, because you're taking oh, a guy. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. Look at the bully. Dude, look at you bashing this front line, dude. I have a great Break respect for the durability of dwarves. They'll be back, you, Jim? And in short... Shorter numbers. You get better. I think your opponent doesn't have any um, unique names. I think he just went with the, the autogen there. Yeah, the, the generic. Yeah. Well, Skaven's Agi 3 too. Even the, the he's just a renegade Skaven, so he could be your ball runner. He's movement seven, dude. Yeah, not bad. Yeah, that little rat is a ball runner. Is ooh, that was close. No! <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna reroll the loner? No, I'm it? not. No. <laughs> That could have been really bad. Alright. Hey, you know, it could be worse. You took three dwarves down. You picked up the ball successfully. You know? Like, that was... I'd say that was a pretty good start for you there. I agree. He might surf you off the pitcher, though. If he goes to the... Yeah, he yeah. could. <laughs> oh, no. But it does... The Slayers have to follow up. So you... Oh, that looks like slow-mo. I Yeah, that, I have a chance to knock him out of here. Which is definitely worth... Like a slayer for a crappy lineman. It's, time, it's time for Bagel Bites <laughs> to uh, redeem himself. Bagel Bites is the pride and joy of the 90s. Yeah, those were great. Those were really good. I'm trying to think, like, what other 90s food was really solid? Um, you remember the... They're still popular, public... but pizza rolls. Yeah. And... yeah, they're not, like, as <laughs> magical as they once were. What were those things called? Those, like, little round pizzas? The little, like, oven microwave deep pizzas? Dish? The Celeste? No, the, little, the Celeste the pizzas. It had, it had, like, the smiling lady on it. It was like a... Yeah, I know we grew up in different states, so maybe it was a little bit different, but... Those, like, little microwaveable pizzas. Hot Pockets were pretty good, too, as well. Yeah. Pop-Tarts were a 90s thing, too, right? Like, Pop-Tarts? Yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah. I, those are they're still, still big, though. Yeah, they're yeah, still, still, big. still popular. So your team is, like... Is things that were mostly popular just in the 90s and kind of fell out of fashion, or is there things that are still no, pertinent? Still, I mean, I, you can still buy Bagel Bites. But super, we got super, super Soakers, we got the Super Nintendo. Uh, oh. Oh. Damn, dude. <laughs> yeah. We got Lunchables. Those are still very prevalent, but... Yeah, Lunchables are great, dude. I used to take those the to school Mighty back Morphin in, like, Power. 97, yeah. You see Goji in chat, he says, yeah, Mom, Mama Celeste. Yeah, it's like, it's something Celeste is the pizza. Those things are great. They were great. I don't know about how they're, if they're good anymore, but. Blockbuster, they're dead. <laughs> AOL. And then my. You know, there's. What? Yeah. There's, you, you know, there's still a Blockbuster, right? Yeah, there's still one more, isn't there? Yeah, we should, we should, like, make some, like, haggard, like, road trip to it someday. The last of its kind. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, I feel like it'd be fun to do. We're going to do some. Wild one die here. Okay, got the one out of the way. <laughs> I feel like that's so punishing that you have to roll a two to even get up. It's like, oh, God. my God, dude. That's some shady stuff, man. Okay. Super Nintendo taking the two die. Did you own any of those game systems back in the day? I, I did not own a... A Super Nintendo. Yeah. Our you, you first gaming... Like, we bought a Sega, 
was yeah. our very first game system, and it broke instantly. <laughs> it feels bad. Like, man. Instantly. Yeah, that's rough. Uh, so, I mean, my parents took it back. It, it was when I say instantly, I mean like we had it for a day. Damn, dude. Unchanneled. So you need a two up here. If you fail, that's gonna feel so bad. Dude. I know. That's why I'm tempted to. I maybe run yeah. my Skaven over, and then I could blitz with my my Dark Elf. Oh, I gotta move mm. somebody else over here. I'm just gonna go for the field bad. I already, yeah, I, mean, I already got the one out of the way. Hey, dude. That's a money play. Getting a Slayer out of bounds is so good. So he's going to probably try to... <clears throat> Turf you now, yeah, maybe. Yeah, so I just got to... Yeah. Uh, let's see here. Okay. It's not a not a trap. <laughs> it's a trap. Nice, dude. I, have great respect for the durability I feel like with this team, you just have to go for shit. It's like... You're gonna have to take a bunch of stupid rolls and like animosity, and like you just have to like just pray to the dark gods it works out, you know? <laughs> God, having a human life is, is rough. Alright. Armor, armor held up there. Bone just wants to be like the ladies in the 90s. <laughs> <laughs> the ladies in the 90s. It's Max Ben Jim. How you doing, man? We might do a Company of Heroes 3 stream later. We might do one after this. I'm not sure. Yes. We'll, we'll, we'll see how we feel. At the very least, we might play some things. Yeah. Oh, look at the bash going. The wind-up. I love it. Uh, that's like the standard Dowie punching animation. They all do it. Like, I feel like they could have given each like team at least like two or three different animations, right? They all have like one. I, it was probably like that in Blood Bowl 2, right? Yeah, like every Dowie hit was the... Uh... They would clomp their hands together, and then they just came in with the right hook. Yeah, yeah, they like would like yeah. Okay. The the winding uppercut is pretty fun though. I did that. So dude, yeah, a troll slayer off the pitch is a huge value, huge value, especially because they can go fight your big guys with the uh, dauntless. Yeah. Hey, he gets to come back though. He didn't get knocked out. Yeah, he'll be back. Same but, with my you know, guy. Thank you. Know, with celebrity deathmatch, you remember that show? Oh my god, that, you know, that show was, for me, a very foundational thing, because I love, like, the idea of, like, who would win in this or that, like, it's hilarious, right. and, uh, yeah, that was great, man, I do remember that. Oh, the golden comment. Yeah. Nothing yeah. good comes from Those spending any time on the ground in this time. game. Got the truck oil changed and didn't get blown away in 60 mile power winds during work. <laughs> good day. Nice to see you made it. How many of you guys in chat, by the way? Um, how many of you guys have played your? Are, how many of you are in the league that we're currently running, and how many of you guys have already played, and what have been your results? Like, how have you had? How have your games been essentially? While we watch Pwn's team get bashed, let's get some updates on the league. I, yeah, I thought about that, Elder, but I can, I can surf this dude, and then. Yeah. I, I mean, I still have like another surf lined up. Yeah, surfing USA. They should have named your team that, dude. With all these like frenzies and stuff. <laughs> Oh, so the corn team has yeah, there's a corn team, yeah, that, right? a corn team. Uh, mm. or at least in Blood Bowl one, and all their players have frenzy. Yeah, got it, got it. So here it comes, fun. My game's tomorrow. Looking forward to it. Good luck, unless you're playing Dowie, then I hate you. <laughs> I am let the like this is literally like everybody's worst nightmare. Like season, <laughs> season one, game one, you got Dowie. You gotta get. You're against a team that has block. And you're just like, oh, yeah. <laughs> not that. I know, dude. It's such misery. That's why I played them. I just didn't want to suffer. I was like, all right, we got to be the ones making. And they, Dowie scale well, too, though. Yeah, they like, scale they, great. They never fall off. They're always good. Yeah. They're always good. Will the big one manage uh, to Michael says he played and rolled over someone who played their first Blood Bowl game ever. Opponent, so <laughs> My opponent is game. playing his first Blood Bowl game ever. Oh, really? Yeah. He's done pretty good. He said, he said he just now heard of Blood Bowl. How about you, Jim? He's doing pretty great. Yeah, okay. It's all good. Anger. Dude, look at the little Renegade Skaven. He can be a good ball carrier too, that guy, with 87 movement. Although he's less agile. Oh, you're, you're going for it? Look at the rat, dude. At the same time. That's pretty sweet. Two dwarves so trapped on big yeah, guys. Yeah, I can surf each of them. They're, they probably won't even stand up. They'll probably just chill there for a while. 
that's what you should do. But <laughs> if I don't know if, if my opponent's listening to the stream, the attacker has an assist. He's, he's stream sniping. Oh. <laughs> See here. That feels so bad, dude. He might be able to go get the ball if I don't. Yeah, you're gonna do it. You know, I, it's my real. only real. <laughs> <laughs> Watch it be double skulls. That's going to cost it. Now it's the other team's turn. I'll rely on Nuffle to screw him. We got Shay in chat saying, I'm playing Nurgle into the Elf Union tonight. It's going to go great. Oh! <laughs> I played that matchup the other night, and I actually won with Nurgle on ladder. Yeah, it's Nurgle with the dis disturbing presence and the foul appearance is really good. Like, they, they, if they roll a bunch of ones on their block attempts, dude, they just like... All you got to do is get as many of his players to surround your beast as possible. It's great. Yeah. It's rough that your Dark Elf's been stuck there for like two turns. Just because of that one episode where you ran up on a UFC fighter and got clocked. What I meant. Oh, my bully beatdown isn't in yeah. the 90s. Bully beatdown is early 2000s. That was, um... That was, um... Oh, what's his name? So they had a couple famous MMA fighters on there. They had Andre Arlovsky, who's a Belarusian fighter, come on and beat up someone, uh, beat up a bully. And then they had um, Mayhem Miller, I think, was the host of that show. Mayhem. He was an MMA fighter who had, like, a massive... Like break, like that like mental breakdown. And like, he comes. Like five, oh, he gets the going for it. He gets the knockdown. Satisfy the grudge. <laughs> <laughs> Just don't armor oh, break. Oh, and he fails the. Oh my God. Oh, you know the rat. You know the rat has to come get it, right? And just run with the ball. <laughs> Not in the league. How long until oh, the next yeah. league? I hope <laughs> uh, oh, there's no the Okay, we got his re one of his rerolls out. Uh, six weeks. What, what is it? Six, it's a six week league? We have six weeks of competition, and then week seven is the Super Bowl. So, um, yeah, so we'll be having them nonstop. This is season one. Um, my season one game's going up tomorrow. This is Pone's first game in the, in the league. And uh, we have a practice league in the Discord, though. Which. Ooh, oh, he burned both his rerolls in this turn, which I don't know how I feel about getting to use more than one reroll in this turn. Well, I'm I guess happy. I would be happy reroll. if I were you, because yeah, I mean he's out now, which I'm happy. Yeah, about. exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so if you join our Discord, we have a. Here's the thing, that we're gonna allow t veteran teams from season one to play again in season two, so you can kind of keep your story going. But if you want to level up a team in the in the uh, Turin Discord. Uh, practice league you can then add that to season two um unless it gets too high team value we're gonna have parameters for that once we get a little bit later in the season but you can level up a team and and have it have the boy watch oh yeah that thing's like move has some moves okay that's respectable <laughs> oh oh anakin that's rough dude that's rough oh. Cl classic big big army yeah if you didn't get dwarves, it'd be way better. You would just be bashing like like AV8 things, right? <laughs> <laughs> Never trust it out. Oh wow! Yeah, always, always trust oh. an elf. Oh. Oh. oh yeah, you, you got to reroll that shit. Wow, what a play by Pwn there! Look at that! Holy shit! Multiple rerolls per turn baits me all the time. Sort of wish it was just one to keep you from rage <laughs> rerolling. Yeah, me too, dude. Me too. I did that today also. Yeah. Wow. Owen just living life on the wild side here. That player could run on wow, oh, run. look at that. And just like that, the game flips. It, the ba the, my perfect bait has worked. Pwn deserves that after all those like haggard like like ones he rolled on his big guys. He definitely deserves it. Yeah. Uh, when I so I played turn the other night. I played a, I played dark elves, and of course, Goji, you'll you'll appreciate the fact that when I went for the I've kept forgetting that now you have to declare your throw all in one movement. You can't like yeah. move your guy around and then chuck the ball and stuff. So. I fucked that up like three times at least, but but then I finally got, I had the double going for it in the end zone, and I I slipped on on the uh, end zone. <laughs> yeah, that was pretty great. That's I, funny. I love it. Yeah.
That was that was a friendly match, or yeah, yeah, was yeah. yeah that was, well, we that was back when so we couldn't do a friendly match, a so we no, made God, a yeah. we made a league with just me and him. That was how we played our now. friendlies. It was so the bad. ultimate scapegoat. It's gotten better now. Like the servers are at least somewhat stable, um, and they did have a patch yesterday, which I think fixed some of the passing bug issues where it freezes. So. Um, Nothing good comes what he's probably going to do is blitz you on the, the bottom there. He's going to grab that Dwarven Blitzer, like base the Skaven, and uh, and probably blitz you and try and get it both down. He could definitely do it. Yeah, yeah. that's that's just a yeah. one dive. Yep. Yeah. Oh, oh, is he not going to? He's not going to blitz you. Holy shit! Oops. It's really, it's really lucky. I don't know if he made a mistake or. He might have made a mistake. Yeah, he's, you can see he's kind of like sitting on that guy, like trying to attack now. Yeah, but he's probably trying to bash me. A good coach yeah. always uses the right yeah. player. Well, the right one dice block. when you have block and your opponent don't is not a terrible idea. Yeah, with block, the only bad result is a, is a player it's down with a skull. Yeah. Ah, he thinks that I'm just going to let him sit there, though. Watch as I become obnoxious. Thoughts, yeah. <laughs> what will they do? Yes. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Imagine having guard on that ogre. Follow dude. me into my ogre. That's a that's a play style with big guys too, right? Like you just let them like like base like four dudes and just like not fight. They just like sit and like yeah, force your opponent that, to deal with high strength. It's yeah. kind of what you're supposed to do, like for the <laughs> most part. I, yeah. Usually people don't use their big guys to bash as much as uh, us noobs like to use them. Yeah, that makes sense. Well, the Minotaur doesn't lose his tackle box right when he rages because it's different. It's like no, he doesn't. It yeah, is, so that's the, with him. It's worth it. Skaven one doesn't either, but he has they changed him so he will attack an ally that's nearby uh, <laughs> oh that's awesome but, oop, i don't want to move him though he's got a prehensile tail so it's harder for people to move away oh from him. minus one to dodge attempts that's dude you're, this team is pretty cool like all the uh Especially all the different once monsters I get the you have troll. yeah oh you can get four big guys on this team uh i think this is the better move right now. yeah you're gonna let's uh let's maybe see if i gonna... can't Oh, you nice! You got the four up. I mean, this is—if you get out of this, you're pretty much home free. The dwarves are gonna really struggle to get you. Oh, El bullshit! <laughs> Away! Yeah, now you're just chilling, dude. Come on, guys, together. Now, now I can play the game. Yeah, now the Skaven. It was looking kind of rough there in the beginning, you know, and he had you back there, and the ball was down and everything. But yeah, the elf, elf shenanigans, man. Yeah, debate him. It's pretty sweet. I mean, that just was having the like old one bait and switch. Yeah, just one elf runner. Pretty red, awesome. Dude. Red dice with block versus no block isn't bad either. <laughs> Only that's true. I, I, it might just leave me with shitty options. <laughs> what are you gonna do with your um, with your elf? Like, how would you develop him? Your dark elf runner. Block dodge. Blodge, yeah, just a blodger. Blodge into sure hands. Yeah, like, animosity sense. means you really don't want to pass or hand off, so kind yeah. of a running team. Yeah, makes sense. It's kind of like... Not dwarf, that I really. can't. Easy. It's just yeah, basically can't. don't roll... It's just an extra step of not rolling a one. Yeah. Which, as we can see with my big guys, happens... What <laughs> happens still. Yeah, yeah. Well, now you're... Are you going to just, like, run to the corners of the map and just, like, wait till the half and then score just so he doesn't have time to bash you more? Or like... Yes. Yeah, yeah. He's smart. Well, I have I have big guys, so and his troll slayer is off the board, so I, I think my bashing attempts here are are forever in my favor. Yeah, yeah, you just like I don't know. Yeah, he only has one slayer on his team. I started with two today, but I lost one of my slayers. Actually, died in my game. Goblets, yeah. Spoiler alert! A great company yeah, to spoiler. be Oh, there's the skull. The, dr the dreaded all rerolls in one turn. <laughs> yeah, coming back to haunt him. That wouldn't even be worth a reroll. Okay, so we are. We're cruising along here. Make sure that nothing happens. <laughs> dude, that feels good. Look at that escape there, oh, dude. Oh, so good and tasty. No capping me. Um, yeah. So if you guys are in the Discord, you can. Uh, we have a Blood Bowl section. You just need to make sure to get the Blood Bowl roll, and um, and you can uh, you can find tons of people to play with. There's been a lot of practice games going on this week, and uh, again, I recommend ma making your team in the Discord practice league. Which you can then if, add to future seasons if you want to switch next season. So you can develop a team on the side and add it to future seasons to keep up with everybody. Yeah. 
yeah, block is a really good spell. There's some abilities which are just so core, like block and dodge, and then there's then there's all these weird utility ones, but um, you can still make your teams really weird. Yeah, you can do a lot of cool stuff. Nice. Okay. Always oh, forever ones. <laughs> but at least he gets to keep that box. That's so good. Yeah, nice two die there. Hey, that Sparta kick. As much as I want to use my rat, it's worth it to keep him there. <laughs> yeah, you just got like the two Dowie pinned down there. So, Pone, why are dwarves your favorite? The attacker has what? an assist. I, I really <laughs> enjoy the Chaos Dwarf team. They're actually really cool. They get those bull centaurs. Yeah, you know, it's yeah they're good. And they, they, don't, they, they have block on like everything, too. It's one of their right? greatest mm, Just on their dwarves. On their linemen, yeah. That's what I meant. Yeah, so no, their great. linemen are technically hobgoblins. Oh, interesting. Okay, so it's a little bit different. Yes, they. Y you get four dwarfs, two bull centaurs, uh, and then the rest are hobgoblins. I. You know how you know how Nuffle's gonna punish you, Pone? Uh, he will find a way. It's gonna. If you win this game, you're gonna have to play me next week, and just you're just gonna have to play dwarves for like the first four weeks. Of your, of <laughs> just, your... just there's six <laughs> dwarf players in the league. I played six of them. <laughs> that would be so. <laughs> <awful>. <laughs> That'd be so awful, dude. Oh my god. Tomorrow I'm yeah, he... returning to my Blood Bowl 2 League with Dark Elves. Have two Blitzers with plus movement, which with well, strength. Oh god, in the lineup with plus age. That's disgusting. And awful, I will never reinstall Blood Bowl 2. <laughs> Just because of that. Oh, yeah. look at him, dude. Yeah, he, brought, he brought over all the troops to make sure he could get a one down. Yeah, yeah. Freedom! Worth it. Dude, how bad would it suck for your team if you look like a big guy died? What is the AV on all your big it guys? Suck. Right. Uh, they're different, so he's nine, he's nine, he's ten. Okay. And uh, I think the troll, troll might be nine too, but trolls got regenerated. Yeah, that's pretty good. I I made sure to get, <laughs> I made sure to get an APOC, like because I couldn't afford another reroll, so I was like, all right, I'll take the APOC in case one of my big guys go down. <laughs> only no, people I'll I... APOC probably. I wish I had taken one too, dude. Feels bad losing a troll slayer. With dwarves, you kind of like you think you don't need it though. You're like, oh, I have thick skull and like you know, tons of armor, yeah, tons of armor, thick skull. Ain't no way you get like that. Yeah, yeah. You might try and surf your rat. You can't surf my rat. You mean the rat? Well, yeah, he he could blitz the guy in the the bottom there potentially do it. If you just. Just that, this is like this is like Warhammer in a nutshell. Just some annoying elf tormenting dwarves. <laughs> this is like, oh my god. I'm excited to see what teams like advance. I wish we had halflings. Would you have played halflings if we had them? Ah, <laughs> uh, probably just for the pure memeage. Yeah, yeah. You got some good wins with your halflings. You were good at you were. I feel like you were getting pretty good at them, right? Okay, I learned from watching people. Yeah, yeah. You let the boy watch. Need to get a player right there. Okay, so here's yeah. how we do it. Yeah, it's you gonna try and do a little, little surfing there. A little surfy surf. Oh, yeah. And then you surf that other dwarf. No, he'll still have a spot to move, but that's pretty brutal. Oh no, dude. Yeah, he's, he's all good. Uh, well. Yeah, you got frenzy, right, on the rat? Ah, yeah. uh, at least they have teammates. Okay. Does he have frenzy? I don't see frenzy on his. Oh, he does. He has a little. Yeah. Man. Damn it. Yeah. <laughs> Invincible <laughs> dwarfs. Yeah, yeah. You're definitely grudging right now, dude. So you received the ball, right? In the first half? I did, yeah. Yeah. Going into the second I second one here. The, yeah, and another thing that everybody loves playing about dwarfs, they don't get hurt, so now it's just zero SPP. It's like, oh. Uh, dude, but, not but in my game today. Points. Yeah, dwarf. high death dwarf game is not. It was a bloodbath, dude. Relax. Both of us took mad casualties. Mom Minnow, damn. 
<laughs> yeah, almost getting through the armor. <laughs> so some of you guys in chat are probably like Blood Bowl veterans. Can somebody explain how they nerfed Claw and Mighty Blow combo in Blood Bowl 3? I know it's not as good as it used to be from the whispers I've heard. So if somebody's a Dark Wizard of Blood Bowl, do let us know. At the same time. I'd like to start a Blood Bowl team and tabletop someday. Be fun. Unfortunately, that's my last turn to bash. You see what Aldar said in chat? He said, I would first action red dice surf your ogre next turn. <laughs> 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 I like that. That's a that's a that's a play. I mean he could definitely make an attempt at it. Oh yeah, why would you not red die that ogre off the field? That's that's like yeah. can't take them together. <clears throat> that's quite the nerf. <laughs> You either get one or the other. So now, claw. Okay, so they don't stack anymore. Now you get one or the other. Thank you, guys. Appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. I was hoping they would have the the uh, giant mercenaries in this game. Which one is it? So, like, in the new Blood Bowl rules, there's giant mercenaries that take up, like, four spots. I think all you can see is their foot. Or I bet you they'll add it at some point. Yeah. Like, you know they're gonna they're gonna squeeze every penny they can out of us. So <laughs> I'm sure there'll be a DLC for a giant's foot. Yeah. The only nerf I was aware of as a new player was uh, Pylon becoming Pile Driver. That would be fun to have a Mighty Blow Pylon player. Like you could still do that, right? Mighty Blow. Like I. Yeah. Oh, he didn't take the red die against you, huh? I thought he was gonna try and push your ogre off. That would have been a good play. It would have been worth. Potentially hurt your ogre. Oh, Cone. What's this? This is called the dreaded three die. Yeah, yeah, if it's going to be pretty... If I'm going to take a bash, it might as well be three, just to make sure nothing goes terribly wrong here. Yeah. Oh, an armor break! Please! <laughs> you, you rolled box card Damn on it. the... Uh, you rolled d dual six on the armor break, though. That would have actually killed him if you rolled it on the injury roll. I know. God, yeah, I want to surf this guy, but uh. <laughs> this match is so haggard. This is the Michael. Yeah, every, every can, match in Blood Bowl is. Can I get? Man, it's so risky to not score, but but. SPP. No, dude. No, dude, don't. You you got to score, bro. Don't don't do this. You have no <laughs> you have no rerolls. I mean, do it. Screw it, the man. The temptations. Do it. <laughs> it's such a I'm trap, a dude. I'm already playing haggard memes. Oh my god, that could have been a disaster. Like, if you got, like, double skulls or both downs? No, dude. What are you doing? Phone. <laughs> You're a madman. Don't do it, Phone. You, it, that's guaranteed SPP up there. This is, like, potentially... You know what? Wait, I embrace the madness, dude. Why can't I blitz it? You have to cl so click it and then double click on him. You have to click it a couple times. It's really buggy. Okay. Triple die. I'll take the SPP too. That could have been really rough, dude. I, w I made sure I had three dice. Yeah, yeah, that's true. You never know, though, man. You never know. Now he gets all of his players back. Yeah, yeah. You get you get one turn. He gets one turn to hit me. Yeah, and then that's it. And then we go into the next half here. <laughs> get Goji just cackling in the shadows. Have you played your game yet, Goji? Or are you are you slacking off? You dragging over there? Goji's gotta love this overtime. I'd hate to see how long it takes him to play his game. Oh my god. Goji's games are gonna be like four hours long. <laughs> Goji's like, oh, better use every last minute of this overtime they give me. <laughs> Not only will he use all the overtime, but he'll also um, he'll also go into actual overtime in the game and just like like double overtime, triple overtime, whilst taking the longest turns possible. <laughs> You're playing on Sunday, Goji? Good, glad to hear it. Yeah, so in this league, it's overtime. There's no ties in this league, um, I don't think. I'm, all the games go into overtime, which is which is good, I think. It's more fun that way. Got to think of that SPP. At least one touchdown. I did. I, I tried for both. He got uh, the green. Uh, yes, 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 yes. Um, Blood Bowl 2 had a lot, had more factions, but they're going to be adding more, of course. It's, a, it's Blood Bowl 2's launch was horrific also, if I remember correctly. Passing gives SPP, right, Bone? 
Well, it and used to. Took old it, old used to it used to give you one. That's if, that's if you completed the pass. Yeah. He should just he should just foul your players here if he can. Uh you run the risk of getting your guys thrown off. You have to roll doubles now. Yeah, you always have to. <laughs> yeah, okay. So I mean on a human with A V well they have A V nine, so they're not like squishy. Is it is it worth it to lose your blocker lineman to take out my human lineman? Like that's one way to look at it. I think you'd be better off if he just bashed my guys as much as he could and then just went for a pass. Yeah, if he had extra players, it would be worth probably. But he right, so. he's yeah. he is. We, we're both tied. Well, maybe. <laughs> okay, we're both tied. <laughs> yeah, no, Warhammer games are notorious for just launching terrible. It's just like it's. I'm trying to think of like a Warhammer game that had a good launch. Warhammer's two launch wasn't the worst. I, I remember that being okay. Warhammer 3's launch was awful. Total War. Um, Total War Warhammer's 1 launch? I can't remember, man. That was too long ago. That was like a different life. I've been playing them in the practice league, but it's rough to get the team going. Yeah, it is. But you'll get there, man. I too am a potato drake. We shall be potatoes together. Should name my team that. Potato drakes? I'm just on. Look at your big guys, dude pretty intimidating I'm happy that there's no ties now I think with this league that's so much better because like if he scores on you then it just goes into like a knockdown drag out kind of battle I think that's way more fun to watch Blood Bowl's 3 launch was worse than the others yeah yeah the launch was pretty horrific there's definitely whoa interesting so you keep your big guys off the starting line to start yeah interesting is this like some MLG high level tactic yeah <laughs> Oh, okay, well, I would. I thought you would just act line with him, but I'm. I don't know. I'm learning watching you. Uh, then I run the risk of all my big guys getting locked down by linemen for us. Yeah, no, it makes sense. Ooh, an onside kick. That is not onside. I know, but it's close. <laughs> you, you get what I'm saying. It's basically like an NFL onside, which is great for you because now, you know. Well, actually, he might be able to get a box on it. That's a good choice for this play. People were pissed about chaos. Looks that's like true. The have finally remembered we're not yeah, the chaos soccer. teams in Blood Bowl Two were kind of stupid when they would get like He's mighty about blow. One. Oh, oh, and Warhammer One. Yeah, yeah. The chaos DLC was egregious. It was, it was pretty bad. Don't know if it's an early game thing, but Black Orcs mainline all being four strength feels really strong. But those good. damn two dodge guys. <laughs> uh, they're pretty good close good. to Lizardmen Always actually. Right Only right I would argue shittier. They have the brawler ability, but. Wizardmen have skinks, and skinks have fucking stunty and like nine movement. I think Crazy. I think the Lizardmen are slightly better than the Black Orc team. Lizardmen are scary strong. They won the Super Bowl of one of the first Wild Hog games we played. Yeah, they're they're, um, they're super yeah. strong, so spooky team. They picked up well, the ball. I said, pick I up the box. He's got sure hands, yeah, right? Yeah, no, I thought he would finish the box first. Okay, there he goes. The, Setting up a bit of a the box. Books. The, the Iron Dairy. <laughs> Dude, how could you not? How could you like elves more than dwarves? Dwarves are so mean? much cooler. They have that like ruins and like just you're all like miners in the deep mountains with Balrogs and shit. <laughs> yeah, and they're all fucking dead. <laughs> not they're, all of they're them. They're too greedily and too deeply. <laughs> yeah. No, I mean all the old races in, Tol in Tolkien-esque right. fantasy are always dying. Like elves and dwarves, they're just like you know. How did this happen? <laughs> yeah. Is it awesome? Ooh, good time. time. It's hammer time. How many runners does he have on his team? Is he running one runner or two? Just one, it looks like. They had a the guy I played against had a double runner build and he did like a big reverse sweep. He like went one side and then passed ran to his other runner and like swept around the other side and caught me off guard. It was really, really nice in our game. Caught you with your pants on the ground. Yeah, no, I was like, oh shit, dwarves actually can like maneuver a little bit. Because they have movement value six. They're like humans, the the dwarven runners. Satisfy the grosh. Let's try and think like, do I, is it worth it to try something like that? That's it, ballsy. The answer is no, it's not. I mean, maybe <laughs> it's your last, maybe it's of your last play of the turn it is. Like, if you just save that for last. Yeah. Look at the little skating. If you had to be a Skaven or a Goblin in Warhammer, what would you choose? 
I'm gonna die pretty quick either way. I guess a goblin. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> I think like 90% of Skaven are just like Skaven slaves, like just like like you just have the worst existence. At least goblins like probably get to like you know have a little bit more autonomy because they're just more you know right. nomadic and whatnot. Yeah. Let's see here, I move there. Oh, Backstreet Boys, nice. Yep, I got Backstreet Boys and NSYNC. Dude, ba I was listening to some Backstreet Boys in the in the car the other day when I was driving to a doctor's appointment. Dude, they uh, they're bangers. Th those songs are great. Some of their um, like Backstreet's back. That song is awesome, dude. Oh, big guy Sometimes stuff. Sometimes cute okay. animals like this forget the sport. Yeah, Night Goblin. They can just eat mushrooms all day and not care. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Being a Night Goblin, I mean, that you know. Yeah, night goblin, being a night goblin would definitely be better than being a skaven. But I mean, if you're a skaven and you're born like a storm vermin, you know, like you get to be like a big scary skaven who has a little bit of power in society, then you know, probably is bet could be better than a goblin. Goblins yeah. don't have dicks. Keep that in mind. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Just some obscure lore facts in chat. What if yeah. I'm Goji? What if I'm Goblin Slayer? Goblins though. Yeah. Oh, is that the, is that that's the anime thing, right? Yeah, like the opening yeah. opening scene has like this lady get raped by goblins. Oh my god, it's horrible, Jesus! They, I mean, they like cut away. You you don't see anything, right? Yeah, it's like inferred. Yeah, it's inferred. What? But yes. I'm just waiting for oh my the god, yeah, it's just some dark shit. Anything. Anime getting Please, all loud. Please, just be interesting. Look at look at Goji in chat. Goji, are we gonna meet Jesus. in the Super Bowl? <laughs> Uh, no. Goji ain't gonna make it to the Super Bowl, and neither are you. <laughs> <laughs> Not if I have anything to say about it. He's playing Blackworks, though, right? Yeah. I that, feel like they're very strong. I almost went with them. I thought they are cool, but I saw that there was, like, two Chaos Renegade teams, and the, the team's pretty meme -y, so I was like, alright. <laughs> Sold. Yes. It's the closest you're gonna get to, like, a halfling team, essentially. My opponent's in the think tank right now. Or DC, one or the other. <clears throat> no, he's probably the big thing. Nothing's frozen. It's not. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. He was just. He's trying to figure out if he wants to like this sweep around the other side. I actually think the better play for him here would be to envelop your like your orc and your weak side because all your big guys are stuck here. Oh my yeah. god, he's doing the handoff. <laughs> oh, the blitz. Yeah. So I think he's doing the correct play here just a sweep like he just like concaves around your other formation and just runs and leaves all your big guys based that's like that's 100 percent the play here but it, he's doing quite well for considering he said it's his first game of blood bowl yeah so his first game yeah of blood he's, bowl he's, ever. he's doing good i think he Probably said he just heard a blood bowl last week yeah yeah let me see let me see you're in so many discords i am yeah uh this is the first week i've ever even heard of blood bowl <laughs> what, a, so, what a beast, dude. Yes. Yeah, good for him. Make sure nobody insult this man if he does anything. I, he's He seems to know the basics. Well, he knows how to box up and stuff. Yeah, yeah. The boy's been All watching. He's not a perfect box, but... Size, though, or else for for yeah. not knowing that you should even box, that's pretty good. I've definitely played worse people on ladder before. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, what's it going to be here? The time is now. Humans swarming. Prevent defense. Now you just gotta. What he needs for you to happen is a bunch of ones on your like haggard big guys, big and boys. then he can just beat you down over big here. Big boys. Yeah. Surprised the troll slayer hasn't blitzed any of your big guys yet. Oh. Hello. Get out of that one. The dual face. I don't know if he knows. Like troll slayers beat up big guys. Can you can you still stack um you can still stack mighty blow and pile on right like and that's like a decent <laughs> combo. I don't I don't know if I would ever have called it like that good of a combo. But Dude, it is that funny. was like the most fun combo. Like yeah, you mighty blow someone and then like if it doesn't work, you just pile on again right and pile drive them. I don't know how that works now. I know they changed it. Yeah, your opponent's playing great. He's playing really good for his first game. Shit, I mean, he might be able to pull something out here, too. So I just... Oh, I so just it begins. 
What if he just ran his runner back the other way and handed it off to the other and just went back the other way? Yeah, really. Then I just, then I'll just walk over that. Respect. Yeah, yeah. He might be, he can actually turn the corner on the other side though. He's the thing. Although you have a lot of big guys over there. Like if he does a handoff and like, uh, if he could get like a one die on your big guy, they're strength five, right? So he would need yep. another dwarf for that. Yeah. Pile drive is just a bad skill. Now that's a shame. That was probably oh, my favorite. There thing. he goes. Oh, look at that. The animosity. He gets the bolt down. That's down goes the rat hooker. Foul him. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, fouling. If he if he felt like that's what he needed, uh. Like to stand this dude up and just follow my dude. And if he knocked it, if he knocked, like even that trade would be worth an alignment. Oh yeah, on a big guy. Yeah. For my big guy. He's got time though. It looks like he's Come just gonna try and bash you a little bit. With a range of new features. Yeah, he just blitzed with the troll slayer, right? As you say that. I know your stream, the stream's behind by about thirty seconds, but oh, right. Stupid. Yeah, yeah, he did the he did the right play. Something's happening. He's now as free as Power a fart in a thunderstorm. What's that? Power Rangers. Oh yeah, show. the OG. Rip yeah. Tommy. You know, was he? He was the one who was an MMA fighter, right? Yeah, the Green Ranger. Yeah, the Green Ranger. Yeah. yeah. He unfortunately, committed suicide. Yeah, it's rough. It's it's a lot of that happens a lot with NFL players, and uh, and I don't know if it had any pertinence, but people who do like football, and, you know, MMA for right. long periods of their life, their the, head banged up. Well, yeah, the CTE. You know, the 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 it, it adds up, and yeah, it's it's really sad. You saw that. I think that's what happened with Junior Seau too. Um, the the San Diego uh, God, he was an awesome linebacker for the San Diego Chargers in like the early 2000s. It's really sad, dude. Yeah, it's getting on to like dark ass subjects here. <laughs> it's it's Warhammer. Yeah, yeah. It's a grim I'm just glad I didn't play college football, dude. Like I played for football Cthulhu. for seven. Years. <laughs> oh. I, I played football for seven years. Tasty. Yeah, and it's just like, man, I'm just like grateful I didn't play more. Cause like in the early 2000s, like. Nobody thought of any of that kind of stuff in the 90s when you were playing football. Like, nobody cared about, like, you know, the, nobody even talked about it. Like, brain injury and all that. Uh, like, using my lineman to attempt to hurt your star player. At what point is it worth going for a penalty? Uh, so, penalties are... If, you, if you're if you playing, like, a numerous team and you have a bunch of extra chaff or crappy players and they have a high-value player down that you can surround and injure, it can definitely be worth it. Um... Like, goblins are notorious for that. Just having, like, 16 players on their team and just, like, going for it. Yeah, yeah, Blast, I hear you. Is the rat jumping up, dude? Time to feast! <laughs> just like Total War. Feast! He almost broke his armor. Got a big guy on his ball carrier, no? That's pretty good. Yeah, that feels good, dude. And his troll slayer's stunned, so he can't really push you off easily. Let the boy watch. Oh, the dreaded one die, huh? We can change that. Our dwarf mirror match earlier was just all one dies. Just like haggard oh, dwarf battle. Oh, oh that sucks that these are rerolling that. Feel like are you gonna ra are you gonna rage reroll or just take it like a champ? I think I take it like a champ. I think you take it like a champ. Yeah. Let's see what the other side can do. The rage reroll would have been funny. Oh wow, look at the big armor. I got value. stunned. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it could be worse. By adversaries like that. I could feel be. like I, I might need to save that for the ball carrier, the reroll. Yeah, so the teams that you're seeing right now, they they both have eleven players. So, like, fouling is a little bit riskier, but if you're playing, like, what would be a good team for fouling that's in the game right now? Uh, Black Orcs. I mean, this team here, if I bring a goblin or... You yeah. Can, Black Orcs have a ton of goblins. Yeah. Humans, basic humans, too. You could have, like, cheap human linemen and yeah, just use I, them. I mean, any you, Dark Elves, yeah. uh, it, it, you, you... So, what you want to do is you want to use your linemen to foul, because if they get thrown off, you want it to be your worst player. Yeah. Right? So, what... Basic, like any team can, dwarfs can do it just fine with the linemen. Yeah, you get dirty player on one of them, and uh, and yeah, and if you if you can get a bribe too, Listen like the pre match. Smells weakness. Oh, uh, KO. You got KO'd. KO. Yeah, he's KO'd. Um, <laughs> should I use an APOC to make sure he doesn't get KO'd? And it would probably end up with him like, dying. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Do you want KO or death? So you have chosen death. Eat it, pwn. <laughs> 
anyone rolling with the roller on Dowie. There is one dreaded player who brought the death roller. Yeah. Of the 10 dwarf teams, I think two of them have death rollers. Because oh. bringing a death roller is a huge setback. Like, you have no rerolls usually, your player quality is worse, but, like, you get that one haggard half where you have a death roller. You well, know? so a death roller gets thrown off the pitch if somebody scores, <laughs> or if the, <laughs> the half ends. So it's... So risque. One die. I like the one die. You can just shove in my minute. Yeah, I mean, no, it was a, it was a fine play. Block one die against the big guy is definitely worth it. I'm not going to do it. Did it actually say that? No. They should have hired you to do the sound effects. Anyone? He has dirty players starting. Yeah, but you don't want to foul with. You don't want to take the time and foul with your death roller because then it's. You get caught, you're done. Unless you got like a golden opportunity to get a player off. Or the last turn of the half. If right. it's about to be thrown off anyways, you just like, oh, poor guy. He could have. Oh, he didn't reroll that. Well, it's not in the worst spot for him. It's like surrounded by a couple dwarves and you as well. Where's my elf? Oh, dude, are you going to do some elf bullshit here? Your elf's right next to the ball, actually. Oh. It's only <laughs> don't, don't do it, bro. It's That's so villainous. <laughs> yeah. We can improve that kind of thing. I'm going to get Dirty Player on one of my Dwarf Line men. I actually got Guard on one of mine today, which is pretty good. Satisfy the pwn. They've wronged us. <laughs> the Urks. You know being a Dwarf would be pretty awesome, though. Dude, they just have like breweries and like build cool shit and just like have this like awesome camaraderie. The only thing is they're constantly kind of upset about something, so there's that like psychological aspect of just being like kind of like angry all the time. Oh, damn, son, look at that, the Skaven. No injuries though. Can't can't break the dreaded injury. Well, uh, I'm gonna upload my game tomorrow. Forget it. Okay, dude, that's so annoying. Please oh no my one. Please, please, no one. Oh god, that's so. That's probably GG for him. Elves. You could just scurry around with the ball and then throw it downfield later. <laughs> just like Gail Marriott and just throw it down there. Yeah. How much does Dawi vindictiveness come from drinking? It's it's a cultural thing for dwarves. Like, gr the whole grudge system, it's just like, I don't think, I mean, there sure, surely is a correlation with the drinking, I, I suppose, but um, I think dwarves in Warhammer Fantasy are also, like, pretty resistant to the effects of alcohol compared to, like, humans. I'm not sure. Like, they can hold their, they can hold their liquor and beer better than humans. They have high endurance stats. This yeah. keeps on going, I don't know about like going, in, in Tolkien, you know, they sh I don't know if it's mentioned in the book, but in the movie, Legolas can outdrink everybody. Because of like elves apparently just like process that kind of stuff. Like, well, yeah. If you remember that scene from Lord of the Rings? Yeah, but in the in the TV show. No. Oh boy, I'm about to. This is called the Frenzy Trap. They're still standing. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Uh, no, no. That's going to cost yeah. you. Now it's the other team's turn. You know he's gonna just do some wild ass blitz on you right now. Just like, <laughs> just try and like <laughs> blitz through eight of my players. Oh. No, like that dwarf in the middle could could he could go to the left and then make one dodge and uh, could be on top of you. That guy. Yeah, he would just like go down. That's that's his best play, I think. Like stand everybody up and then do that. Or he could pass, just like in this turn. Yeah, he could just pass his turn to you. And give up. <laughs> That's, really good. That's the other option he has. I think he's going to make him suffer. In that round with 11 places. Yeah, I got, dude. Oh man, I don't want to give spoilers for my I game. It's going up tomorrow, but there was there was some really that was one of the most bloody, brutal games I've ever had in Blood Bowl. So many deaths <laughs> and injuries and permanent injuries, like armor value, strength. Like our team's got maimed for a double Dowie, yeah. by the way. Yeah, <laughs> it was a double Dowie mirror match. Yeah. As you watch me bash these Dowie senseless, and you're like, "Damn, these guys are unhurtable." Then turns like everyone died. <laughs> it was it was a massacre. Yeah. He's there was the blood one. everywhere. He's taking the one die push. Yeah, ah, awesome. 
as long as he doesn't re-roll it. He's probably going to save that for the dodge here. He's got two re-rolls, so he definitely should take yep. some chances. Or he can pass. <laughs> Just he's got a, he's playing quickly. Him, always want him playing to know quickly. His, his, uh, his options. Phenomenal. Or why is they should have resolved the entire oh, he... Blood Bowl match. But uh, made more sense. <laughs> See, he didn't do. Um, he didn't do it. He, he definitely could, could have blitzed you there. That would have been the play. A one die. You know, he would only need a three up dodge. I think. Well, I mean, he still bases you, but your elf shenanigans are going to be real here. Go, big guy. The, blood. the end times is just stupid, though. You know, like it's it's not like end times wasn't done for the sake of story. It was done for the sake of just like ending. And progressing into Age of Sigmar. It was literally just like brushing like an, an IP out the window. Like the end time stories are just so terrible. It's just like yeah, it's oh god, I hate it. It's so terrible. They could have just like honestly, yeah, man. It was just poor leadership at the time. Like with end times, they could have just been like, hey guys, you know, we're gonna start, we're gonna move on to uh, a, a new game. We're not going to support fantasy now, but we're going to get back to it in a couple years with Old World or whatever. And like, there's so many better ways they could have done it. Because then they could have just rebooted fantasy with Old World and just kept the same timeline with all the characters, so people could play like the characters they like. Like Old World's going to be cool, but it, it's it's like the human characters are all different. And like, who doesn't want to play Carol Franz and Balthazar Gelt and like all these characters, right? That have like 20 plus years of lore and are awesome. Yeah, it's 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 kind of a shame. Yeah, it's a shame. Oh, look at that. Phone, you gonna score again, dog? Might. It'd be nice if I could get a guaranteed level up on my block here. You, you get dodge first, probably, right? Or would you get block first? Uh, not that much tackle, I'd probably want dodge first. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, dwarves are the only ones who tackle. <laughs> I just wanted to make sure I have a plus yeah. dice in case he decides to just stand me up and blitz and come at me all ha ha haggardly. His best play would be to dodge with the dwarf on the Minotaur, I think, and go up and around and get a one die on you. Okay. That, yeah, we'll see if he does it. Oh, yeah. It, 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 certainly. One die blitz on your ball. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, I, I know. <laughs> when, I, when I did the blitz here, that's why I, that's why I scooted the old rat over here. Get some people. Over yeah, he's gonna be able to attack the box. Yeah, Warhammer Fantasy wasn't like making a lot of money, but it, it doesn't mean you need to like just blitz right blitz the setting down and just karate right chop it. Like they could have they could have just like said they're doing Age of Sigmar, which is like takes place in the distant future, you know, or something. I don't know. There's any number of ways. Alter the alternative timeline. Yeah, it could be an alternate timeline. Like Haven't they ever heard of the the Marvel multiverse? There you go. The dreaded lost prime. Now he can Sigmar. make that. I know. <laughs> He's gonna get you, dude. Nope, he didn't. He did not. He's just taking the basing. Yeah, he should have blitzed you there. I think it would have been a two red die though, right? No, it would have been a one die. He's got a guy here based with all this, so. Oh. Or so he could have moved this guy like over, and then as long as he puts somebody in this scaven zone, then he gets a, a one die. He might not have known that he could do that. That's true. Remember, guys, this is his first game ever, so he will learn. I mean, he's already. Like I said he's for his first game ever. He's he's made some decent moves. Yeah. That's it. For some uh -oh. back and Kapow! That looked like an extra like powerful <laughs> uppercut, but it just didn't do much. But a four for injury. The attacker has an assist. Oh. oh. That's not good. He yeah, you definitely have to take the reroll here. The and then... has an assist. Take the red die. <laughs> take the skull. Just suffer. Phone, you see magic is coming out with Lord of the Rings set? Yes. They've been, like, that's been teased for like a year. I, I don't have a lot of hope for it, because the, the Warhammer set was pretty bad. Like, Abaddon I, was a I good love card. The Warhammer set. Did you see the Mortarian? Like, I have a Bellacord they... deck. How dare you? Oh. oh! The Chad Dwarf dodge! Oh, oh he the gets it! Down. Such as voice oh! <laughs> I love it. That was a it's, that was a really manly play right so there. So it's up to the Skaven then. <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. 
he's going to stop me from getting my level up. But... Well, you might get. We'll see where you get your MVP. That's true. Are a great company to be affiliated with. <laughs> oh, dude. Did he, re he did reroll and he failed no, again. He didn't. He, didn't. he didn't. Oh, no, he still has. No. Yep. Does he have time to score? No, he doesn't. No way. This player likes to be well assisted in a fight. Once again, it's up to the skater. <laughs> Oh, dude, what if that dwarf just grabs the ball and just runs to the end zone? <laughs> that would make I me a sad fat. I guess it's possible for him to score here, but it would take, like, the stars aligning. I almost want him to score just so we can get more game, you know? <laughs> it's just fun to watch. Okay, this is, <laughs> yeah, this is what we save our rerolls for. Not yeah. a wise place to end your turn oh, on the rat. of the pitch. Oh, no. <laughs> if the player Wait. Oh. pushed into the crowd. Oh, I used my reroll. <laughs> no, I, I thought I still had it. I used it earlier. So what he needs to do now is blitz you with the dwarf on the ball, push you push me up, on. and then stay, and then grab and run. Oh, my God. He could totally do this here. Oh, he just took that guy up. No, the dwarf next to the ball. Yeah. Help those teeth, Jim. He's just going for those bashes, dude. He's, Homeboy's just trying to get some SPP here. My elf will be back. If he doesn't get this ball. Gollum spoiled. Seems strong. I didn't see what his exact skills were, but... He, so Gollum is a... He's a 2-1, I think for one mana or two mana. I'm not sure. Oh, wait, no, and, you told me about that. Never mind. Yeah, and every yeah, time he yeah. attacks, you can... like It's like a little guessing game. Kind of right. like a riddle. Yeah, pretty fun. What oh, yeah. do I have return. in my pocket? So, I know. I'm always terrible with riddles. Are you good with riddles? No. No. You, there's a, have you ever played the game uh, Dirty Minds? No, I haven't. No. So it's like, it's kind of like a riddle game, but everything's dirty sounding, right? Got it. And I can't not not think of anything else. Always uses <laughs> so, you know, I'm like, it's a penis. It has to be. There's literally nothing else it could be. And they're like, it's a spider. I'm like, oh, yeah, okay, I see it now. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah, yeah, that makes sense. Oh, my gosh, the Chad 6. Oh, he's got to run for the end zone, though. Hopefully he knows that. Because he won't make it in just yeah. next turn. He's got... He ain't got the movement cotton. You gotta run for it! Please, please don't stand there. Okay, the real Yes! Run. Stop him, Mario Skaven! No! Oh, oh! The dwarf! Did he go far enough, though? He's got one more free movement. He needs to take it to avoid the GFIs next turn. He needs to take it. Five, six. He's only got six movement total, so he has to... No, but... He has to keep going right now. Uh, like, he yeah. cannot reach the end zone from there. Yeah, he needs to go. You're going to get a blitz on him with your Skaven, regardless. Oh, no. Did he just throw the game? He cannot score. That's sad. I make absurd, oh, I absurd amounts of mana. Set creatures. So many things. What is this? A blind halfling's okay, match so or something? Stand you up. Stand you up. That feels bad. Are you sure you can't score? He has movement score. No, it's six. Oh, that's a lineman. Oh, so he couldn't have scored no matter what. No, he could have. He could have moved. He here, would have had to GFI. And then yeah. GFI. Yeah. 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 He was. He was close. The the dwarven dream was alive, but he would have had to make a couple going for it. So the odds weren't great, but with, because Pone would have based him with the Skaven and forced another dodge. So the odds were low, but yeah, he would have had a chance to score there. For okay. Sure. Got the one out of the way. Yeah. There you go, dude. There goes my hero. I should probably say something meaningful to all that, our that movie the other guys with Dwayne, uh, with uh, Samuel Jackson and Dwayne Johnson, and they like jump off the building, like aim for the bushes. Yeah, that was literally the best part of that movie. That yeah, it was. it's the only part I remember. I don't remember. Anything I, I mean, the movie, the movie itself is good, but that was without a doubt the best part of it. And it has, uh, and it has the Foo Fighters, my hero, playing during that bit. That's so, so good. He, yeah, he could actually push his own guy, I think, right? Into. Oh, dude. Hey, well, going for it. Oh, he could push his guy down and get extra movement. That's a pretty advanced play. He's in, he's brand new. I don't know if he'll see that. Yeah, that's probably not terrible either. So I 
satisfy the grudge. I mean, I guess I might as well go for the pure memeage of this. Yeah. He can't score right now, so let's. No, he can, dude. If he, uh, if he, push, if he chain pushes. As PP? No, just a KO. Joking! <laughs> You're gonna love him! KO! Alright, let's see what's going here. You're gonna do it, you're gonna get the little... I'm gonna attempt to get a 2 die. Uh, okay. Oh, nice, dude, nice. So if you get this, then he doesn't need to feel bad because it would have happened regardless. <laughs> you know? I don't yeah. have a reroll, so... Okay, we got... Oh. Yeah, so he, he wouldn't have scored anyways. So, you know. Unless the ball... Hmm. Could he still score? I don't think so. Yeah, no, it's not true. No, that was a good game, though. Good scrap, dude. Coming out with the dub. Yes, sir. <laughs> Quit, dude, you, you know you have to foul right now. Well, next turn. <laughs> uh, no, I'm going to attempt to score again. Oh, you're going to do a pass? Look at that, dude. Look at Pwn planning ahead. Just the veteran plays. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Oh, what a bittersweet. Yeah, what a bitter way to end the game. It's the other team's go. Okay, so now you grab the ball. So, let's do one of the worst things we can do. <laughs> Get in <laughs> there! there. SPP! This guy's frenzy, right? Yeah. Oh, and a triple die. Good wow, for the triple it. die. <laughs> Now, don't forget to activate the pass activation before you do it. Yes. It's something that, like, a lot of people miss. Me. Did you activate the pass activation? Not yet. You almost forgot. I, I was just trying to see, like, how, <laughs> how this would work here. Wow, if you make this, that'll be pretty intense. We'll, we'll just take all the dice rolls. I, think, I don't think it makes a difference if you're in the green box. Uh, it's got your zone, so like this is short, medium, or short. What's so if you just get, yeah, zone? okay, I got you. Yeah. But if you just get behind your ogre, doesn't it just give you a? Isn't it within the green zone? So it would just be the same pass without with less rolls. I don't know how it works, so that's what I'm asking. No, it's a long pass right there. Got it. This is a short pass. There goes my hero. You grease the ball. Oh, <laughs> and, and it's done. <laughs> yeah, just like that could have been an epic play though. Should have ate that, that popcorn. Really yeah. What? Connection lost. Okay, I think it it, it ended it. Okay, yeah, good. A, it, I think mine said that every single time. Yeah. Oh, I got it. I got. Oh, it's only four SPP for for MVP. Yes. That's they great though. Minotaur. MVP. Oh yeah, it's wonderful. I mean, all I have to do is injure something and I get a level up. Yeah, and you get a block on the him, which would be brutal. Uh, oh, uh, well, how ex can you get it off of one level up? Do you get enough? I, I did. I did on my dwarves. I don't oh, know okay. about how it works for a big guy. Yeah, I don't know. GG, man. That was a good GG. game. GG. Uh, a good scrappy tell match. Tell my old opponent a GG. <laughs> they are third. That was a great game, man. Well played. Yeah, that was really good for a first time, which is exactly what I'm sitting in right now. Block is 6 SPP if strength is your primary characteristic. So on my dwarf, I got block on a guy today because it, it only costs 6. You know what I think you should do, Pwn? You should roll a random mutation on your um, on your Minotaur. Oh, is that what you think I should do? <laughs> yeah, dude, do it. No. Do it. <laughs> <sighs> We're going to not do that. You get you could get like the big... Yeah, you'd probably get something that's terrible. Let's see. Yeah, 7 SPP is not bad. No, I'll take it. Yeah, it's a touchdown, and uh, yeah, that's some good stuff right there, man. Alrighty, thanks everybody for stopping by. Turn, thank you for hanging out. Yeah, it was fun, dude. I'm fun gonna go. Always. I'm gonna go feast, and then uh, we'll see if we're down for some company of heroes. Or... Sounds good, man. We'll okay. uh, we'll do yeah, it. I'll hit you up in a in a second. Sounds good, brother. All right, bye. In chat, thank you guys for stopping by. We got the first dub in the books. Block would be 12 SPP for the middle, I believe. So, uh, we are uh, on our way to the Super Bowl, just like that. Go G turn, you guys better watch out, because uh, I'm coming. The unstoppable 90s, bro. The 90s, just pure nostalgia, nobody can take it, because this is a boomer league. Peace out, guys. I will 
if Taran's down for Company of Heroes, I will be streaming that as well if if he's down to, to do it. So, peace out, Girl Scouts. <laughs>